Sister chromatids are bound together by cohesins, which probably form a ring around the chromatids. There is a special histone protein, which only binds to the DNA of centromeres. Uh, this then attracts other proteins of the constitutive centromere-associated network, or CCAN. There are about 15 of these proteins in humans. Some of these proteins bind DNA, while others bind to that histone protein, SEMP-A. These form the inner plate of the kinetic core, which then bind to proteins of the outer plate of the kinetic core. These outer plate proteins include NDC80, which is a complex which will attach to microtubules and allow for movement along the lateral surface. So the kinetic core slides along the lateral surface of a microtubule as it moves towards the pole. Once it reaches the pole, NDC80 uh, will then attach to proteins found there, DAM1, on the microtubule and uh, attach more firmly so that the uh, kinetic core is a attached appropriately. This then swings the sister chromatid so that the opposite kinetic core faces the opposite pole of the cell and this will help the attachment of a kinetic core fiber from the opposite pole of the cell to that kinetic core. 